back I will I could uh, after uh, send you a link for our video uh, when we'll do it. Yeah, yeah. Everything? Yes, yeah. I think so. Thank you. Man. Well, take care. Enjoy really your journey. It was really nice to meet you. Good to meet you. And uh, take care of yourselves and enjoy. Enjoy every single moment. Well, today we're. Uh, left our friend who, with whom we were living like four days in a camping and now today we would like to go to the mood baths but there was closed we were uh, late for three days and it's pretty pity now we're going to a natural park uh, with a river it should be really beautiful there uh, and now we're waiting on a petrol station which is located n in the nowhere because there is no people only two owner and uh, his friend um, you see there is no cars no traffic at all it's pretty nice it's pretty calm Αν αναφέρω το σύσδεξ απλά Ναι ρε παιδί μου με την έννοια για να μπορέσεις εσύ να κλείσεις το δικό σου έργο Άμα όλα αυτά τα καλωδιώσεις μέσα σε ένα ράκ Το οποίο είναι πάνω, δίπλα ε, Στα πλάγια ναι, ναι, ναι. από το μελετημένο ναι, ναι. Φαντάζομαι γίνεται αυτό που λες ναι So right now we're ready to start our hiking uh, trip because we're planning to go to over that mountain uh, there is a river which is going so we'll go behind the river and we'll not go up to the mountain we'll go behind and uh, uh, I think it will take us some days because it's like 20 kilometers The God. A uh, small observation while we're we're going on the trail, on the nature and the na in the na in the nature park. So if you see the rubbish, because it's 
it's everywhere actually the small rubbish and you see it and you think oh man it's rubbish and people like throwing away the rubbish everywhere that's bad but actually sometimes you see rubbish and you and you say and you're telling yourself like huh it's rubbish so there was a person over here so actually i'm not lost i'm somewhere in civilization where a village or the town is nearby and in the case of emergency actually you will not die so the rubbish has also like some positive effect And one more thing about rubbish and I know that this uh, is actually the discussion if the actually rubbish is bad etc but I imagined one example where actually rubbish is something which reminds you about hum humanity like if you're like you're traveling in the space with your spaceship and you didn't see already for quite a long time the the people and our civilization everything is empty and you're coming on a random planet you're you're walking over there thinking your thoughts and suddenly you see a, a used can of coca-cola over there and you was like uh, and you're saying yourself like mmm that's a humanity that's a that rem rem uh, reminds me about about people so it's it's actually something good when you miss it Mm -hmm. Итак, мы находимся сейчас на заброшенной железной дороге, на которой мы попали из леса. На самом деле мы шли рядом с рекой, и дело в том, что железная дорога идет как бы в горе и через гору. И чтобы на нее попасть, нам пришлось преодолеть некоторое расстояние через кусты, палки и всякое колющееся, режущееся. И мы очень рады, что мы добрались до железной дороги, потому что в тех кустах было не очень понятно, куда мы идем. Да и дорога была заброшена, поросшая шиповником. Было очень неблагоприятно на ней находиться. Сейчас, конечно, положение изменилось, но теперь мы надеемся, что она заброшена и поезда здесь не ходят. А если ходят, то придется отпрыгивать. Такие дела. Пройдемте вместе и посмотрим, что происходило внутри. Идите сюда, не бойтесь. Должна сказать, что если перевести фокус камеры э, вот на этот угол, который порос немного мхом, кирпичом и желтыми проплешинами, Именно из этого угла великий человек, известный как Ван Гог, написал свою первую работу, назвав ее «В сердце болот». Эта работа символизирует собой начало, которое отождествляет человеческую волю и человеческое существо как что-то, что несколько видоизменяется, что нельзя удержать в цепях цивилизации и кирпичей, камня и других цементнообразных структур, и которая уходит, куда бы вы думали, вверх, через стены и через крыши.
So when we passed the tunnel we found a really nice spot for camping where we stopped in that crowd. Красненько горит? Красненько горит. Окей, пойду тогда за водой. Good morning everyone, today we have a regular like simple meal as a fisherman, as Jesus Christ had also, like muesli with the fruits, with the adventure food, uh, which we have with our proper <laughs> bread, which we did on the camping, and a tea with a peppermint, which we found near the river. Today was a today's night was an interesting night because we met a fox who tried to steal my cup because it was smelling with maybe tea or the fish and she was doing uh, some of the noises during the night like and then she was walking over the river so it was uh, really listening to that I was uh, and afterwards there was dogs near like 3 4 a.m. was starting to barking a big group of dogs which uh, were in the nearest mountain not on the uh, hour but on the other side of the river uh, and they were like doing that quite a long time what else also I understood that actually the um, forest or like jungles or like whatever they're uh, like listening every time yes every time someone listening what's happening and actually you also do that because uh, there are a lot of bikes a lot of birds which doing the sounds and sometimes where the for example the fox ca came and started to do the noises so everyone was silent no bikes no birds nothing just the fox was and I was like listening to her, like waiting when they, when she will go away. And once she went away, there were birds starting to do the sounds and also the bugs. And you understand that, okay, now it's fine. Now it's silent, peaceful. And then the dogs came, they started barking. And uh, one more time, like everyone was just listening and no no sounds uh, except the barking of the dogs were made. And in that time, I also was thinking about 
that uh, if uh, about the thing, way of the thinking as a aborigine, uh, as a primitive uh, person, because actually in the night when when <clears throat> when you're in a tent or somewhere which is not really safe, you you're thinking about stuff and you her and you listen the noises and you you're telling to yourself like you're not telling but it's very easy to to believe in the in the spirits in the good or bad spirits at the fox she did some sounds and he was like hmm, maybe it's a bad spirit like hmm, because it's mysterious in the night we don't know what's happening it's also the hostile world outside from from your shelter <clears throat> so yes i think that's how it works so you're hoping that you ha you will have some uh, superpowers and could um, interact with those ghosts and spirits uh, that for uh, that, that they don't do anything bad to you and so maybe you do some rituals etc so i think that's how it works Ты можешь, а вон там по железному можно идти все. Ох, надеюсь, я не провалюсь. По железному лучше весна. Я посмотрел. У меня вот тут, где кусты, короче, неприятные. Не видно, где дыры. Ой-ой. 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 Ого. Эти небольшие тоннели. So at this abandoned railway there was a lot of dark tunnels which were very beautiful inside and we there met some sleeping bags. The granite hollowed out from the inside shimmered in a different shade with a yellow and a brown lines. Inside the tunnel was blown by the wind and at the exit numerous cobwebs on the rails glittered and moved. So 
it's uh, one hour already from our morning, from our beginning, and we're still going uh, through the railways, railway path to um, our point. To maybe we're we're measuring that today or tomorrow we'll finish that route. So if it will be tomorrow today, we need to pass like a 15 kilometers more. So we did a half of a trail, um, or we'll do it tomorrow. We just go. Осторожно, могут быть гвозди. Rivera. We arrived to our destination. This is our station and we'll now wait for the train. <laughs> so now we're going uh, in the tunnel through the hill, through the mountain and we really hope that the train will not go and as you see we go through the from the past to the dark future of the tunnel world or maybe vice versa it depends how you think about that Смотри, чтобы тебя аллигаторы не съели. So it looks like our trail is finishing and our railway path is also went to the left and we went a little bit from the right, from the real path and uh, I will be missing that railway trail and, and, the, and the trains and the tunnels. It was fun and now we're just regular tourists going on the path which is pretty, pretty like yeah. Mm. So 
so we finished the trail the railway trail and now we're uh, we're in the parking spot where there's a lot of people there's a village nearby and uh, do you remember about rubbish but I spoke in the beginning that like like that like rubbish is a thing about civilization uh, I'm taking my words back it not it, it just not nice when there is a lot of rubbish because we just came from the trail and there is like ton of rubbish not ton but still like people are, uh, how how do you even kind of like like how how do you can leave that like like you, you you had your like Red Bull or something and and now you just leave it on, on the ground is it like normal Oh Jesus Christ that's sick, sick bastard. But fishes.